Hello everyone, this is SA Technology and in this video I'll talk about bootloop problem, how you can solve that problem, what is bootloop problem, why, why it happened and to know how to fix it, you must understand what's happened when you get a bootloop issue. So yeah, in this video I'll talk about how LG G6 solved bootloop problem, so you shouldn't pass on this device just because you had bootle problem on previous devices so yeah I'll mention how G6 how LG solve bootle problem and why you should buy still buy this phone okay so here I am and uh, probably you can see a little bit of change and that is because now I'm re recording with the G6 with wide angle so that's why I will not be able to show you G6 anymore but here I have V10 a lot of them had a bootle problem with the V10 or LG G4 some of them had with the LG G3 and uh, I was in the past using this phone for two years this uh, half a year and now I'm using LG G6 and uh, me personally, quickly I'll just mention, then I'll go on bootloop problem. Uh, I get a little bit of bootloop problem with this one. With this one, I didn't get a bootloop problem. You gotta know what is a bootloop problem and why it's happening to understand how to fix it and to not uh, get to not get a bootloop problem. So please stay stay with me. I'll try not to be boring. <laughs> so yeah, this phone does get hot sometimes. It's fast and everything, it does, but it does get hot sometimes. But one time when it get super, super, super hot, I was doing, I, I think I was recording a lot or something. Anyway, it phone was super, super hot. And then I got notification that uh, temperature is too high. On the CPU and phone will turn off and uh, then I was thinking oh my god I'll probably get a bootle problem but I didn't everything was fine uh, so I think that even on these devices LG kind of uh, through the software a little bit solve bootle problem because when it will temperature go too high they will turn off device which is again not good you can use device for a few minutes but at least it will not go into bootle problem. And uh, why bootle problem? It's happening when your phone goes uh, when your phone is too hot. Here I have G3 and already moved screws, so yeah, it's not a problem. And uh, quickly, I'll just move this. Okay. So yeah. Quickly, I'll just show you bootle problem why it's happening. So here we have we have CPU and GPU on the motherboard, and uh, this, yeah, this is CPU. This is a processor, and the uh, processor get really super hot. And I'll show you now what's happened. What can happen? Okay, now I'm in normal angle. Just a second, let me focus in. Okay, so if you can see those pins here, when when uh, phones get really super hot, uh, sometimes uh, they are disconnect, so they are not connected anymore, and that's why your phone goes in the boot loop, and you cannot turn on the phone or something, you have any problem. Yeah, why? Because that is disconnected. Okay, so how to solve boot loop problem? Probably a lot of times on YouTube you saw that uh, some guys were uh, making that CPU really, really super warm with the heat gun or something. And uh, yeah, that is really good. And you don't need to be scared to watch uh, to do that. It's not that hard. And at least if you try, you can save your phone or data but if you don't try you can't do anything yeah so you need to hit that and press that so those pins connect again and then it will work so that's why uh, that is boot loop and how it's happened 
and uh, also you can do so if you get a boot loop and you fix this I'll recommend you to put a little bit of ther thermal paste and this is thermal paste that I really recommend this is the best and it's not expensive uh, I don't I think around 10 uh, euros dollars something like that and link of that it'll be in the description so put a little bit of that on CPU and uh, that will cool your device and that is genius way how LG solved the problem on a G6 Flipping over the motherboard, we get our first look at the thermal gel that lies between the main processor and the copper heat pipe. The processor is the hottest part of a working cell phone, and there are several things working together to keep it cool. First of all, the frame of the phone is metal, and that processor is located directly in the center of the phone, and since metal is a good conductor of heat, the foam body itself is working as a heatsink. The bulk of the cooling is done by that thermal gel and the copper heat pipe though. This is even more effective than the metal frame. The copper is wicking heat away from the processor and pulling it towards the edge of the phone away from the main board and battery. Now I've always been curious as to if these heat pipe contraptions actually work. So I set up a thermal imaging camera with two LG G6 phones in front of me. The one on the left with the circle sticker has no heat pipe inside of it and the other on the right is a normal LG G6 with a heat pipe inside. And now that we are looking at the visible facts, it's easy to see that the phone with the heat pipe is performing much cooler. And a cooler phone means it will last longer and improve the lifespan of your device. A longer lasting phone is always a good thing. That is the way how LG really solved bootloop problem and it's really great. So your phone, if you buy an LG G6, it will last longer, it will not get hot, it will not get a bootloop problem. So you don't need to be scared. And if you do get any other problem, LG gives you two years of warranty on LG, I mean. And now you can find this phone for, I don't know, $400, euros, and uh, some, some companies even, even giving you like Google Home or television or something with it. So I think LG G6 is the best value for money, especially because it has Dolby screen, Dolby Vision screen, which is amazing for watching movies, believe me. It has a wide angle camera and believe me, like any other phone. And it has design, IP68, water resistant. It's really a great phone. So forget about bootloop problem that happened in the past. The same like, like Notes had problem with uh, with this Note Seven. They had problem. They solve it. Everyone forget that. Everyone forget bootloop problem. And yeah, I really recommend you to buy G6. It's a great device. And uh, yeah, so that was it. I explained how you can solve bootloop problem. Why it happened. How LG solved bootloop problem. Thank you for watching. I really hope that you, that you like this video and uh, subscribe for more. I'll have much more interesting videos, tutorials, reviews, some vlogs in the future. So stay on my channel. This was SC Technology. Thank you for watching, like I said, and see you in the next one. Bye.